Hello guys, in this series we will learn how we can use drop zone in Vue.js with Laravel. If you don't know drop zone, let me tell you that drop zone is a JavaScript open source library that provides drag and drop file upload. In this series, we will use drop zone specifically for image uploading. Okay, so let's start the video. For this video, I already installed Vue.js and Laravel on my machine and both are running on different ports. In Vue.js, I will use this component for drop zone. The link of this component is provided in the description of this video. I open the documentation of this component and install it via npm. Go to your project and run this command in the terminal. As you can see, the installation is completed. In this video, I want to use drop zone in this hello world component which is a default component. The output in the browser which we see is the result of this hello world component. Now I want to remove these things and use drop zone in this component. Now let's copy and paste the code from this page to our project. First thing is to import and register it. After importing and registering, let's use it. As you can see, we are using a prop here. Now let's also define it. You can read about these options on this website dropzonejs.com but I want to explain them briefly. URL is the URL of the API where you want to send the image. Thumbnail width is the width of the thumbnail. When you choose an image, dropzone shows its thumbnail. Max file size is the maximum size of each image. You can also pass some data in the header of the request like auth token etc. Ok, our frontend work is completed. Now let's see the result in the browser. This is the thumbnail. Now it's time to make a Laravel API. I run this command to make a Laravel controller. The controller name is image upload controller. In this controller, I write a simple function. This simple function get image from the Vue.js request and move to the storage directory. Last thing is to define a route for this function. Ok, now I update the URL option of the drop zone and test the code. As you can see, the image is uploaded here. Thank you for watching this video. This was the first video of this series. For more videos, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon.